Hey there guys, how's it going? And what we're going to be talking about today is the big boys here, the 16, 16 inch <laughs> fan palm. This is the fan palm wear tongs. Yes, this is 16 inch. These are monsters. Okay, they're really, really big and really long. Now, what I use these for is I use them for because I am an avid, an avid barbecuer. Okay, so I use these to turn meat and to, you know, just get in there and flip over all kinds of uh, different things that I'm barbecuing. Yeah, they work very well. They are very reliable. I believe this is a, a, an aluminum um, aluminum pair. I've had these for about maybe seven months. I had another pair that I got kind of bent. It wasn't the same same ones as these, but I got these, and these have been doing very well by me. Now, most people may, I mean, decide to use these like for salad or something like that, and tossing salad, but. I avidly, avidly use these for my meat. Even if I'm not barbecuing, sometimes I'll use it on the oven. You know, when you, you just need to get in there. Like if you're making sausages, not so much burgers or anything like that, but any kind of meats that are in a whole piece, like say one big pork chop. Or even a steak, you know, but I or perfect. These are perfect for uh, chicken legs. Like you know, just grab them, turn them, yeah, just like that. Really, really good. You know, if you're into barbecuing, you know what I mean. This is really, really a necessity to have. Now, like I said, you wouldn't use these for. I mean, I wouldn't anyway for burgers or anything like that or anything that was like kind of hard to grab that's kind of small like i don't think i would actually i have tried to use it for bacon but it wasn't that good <laughs> they're a little too big for that uh but these are good really good for for pork chops steaks chicken ribs ribs really good for ribs any kind of whole meats like that even to if you're even doing like carne asada you know you're like tossing it you know getting it on there and you know mixing it around and everything like that it's really good you know i also have a smaller pair that is for um smaller pieces of meat but this one really does well really well and I've used it for a while now and haven't had an issue. Now, I wanted to say that there was no downside, but actually at one point I had, I was using these and this end here kind of got bent out of shape here. I'm not sure why, but it kind of opened like this and then kind of bent like that for, for some reason when I was using it. But I was able to pop it back into, into its, its place for, and it hasn't happened again. It was kind of a fluke. It was kind of strange how that happened actually. It did, but now it's kind of like new again. I just had to kind of bend it back here and uh, put it back into its original shape because I guess the meat that I was picking up, the meat I was picking up at the time was a whole half a chicken. I grabbed it like that and then I picked it up and I think when I turned it somehow, I was holding this one and the... I was holding both of them actually, but I think I was putting most of my strength on this one. And part of the chicken wing flipped over on this side and was pulling this one down somehow, some way. But that half a chicken was uh, kind of heavy, I guess, and caused this end kind of to pop out. It was strange. It was a weird fluke, but it never happened again, you know. 
I've lifted heavy, heavy things with this since then, and it was, it's been fine. So, don't think this is just for light stuff, no. Really good for sausages. I really like using them for sausages. Yeah, yeah, these are really good. I guess just be careful of this end here. Make sure nothing gets popped out of place. Yeah, not very expensive. I guess in the mediocre, the medium area of, you know, how much tongs would cost. And they're very good. I like them a lot. I'll continue using them. <laughs> yeah, okay guys. Well, that is the 16, 16 inch fan palm wear tongs. Yes, I hope you guys use this information and I will see you next time. Okay, bye-bye.